So this is a 200 amp service rated transfer switch and I just wanted to explain how to use this load shedding module instead of a smart management module. This comes with the transfer switch. So if you have access to the thermostat wires that go from the thermostat to the air handler or from the air handler to the condenser, it's best to use this because it doesn't really cost any money other than this wire. So this is like an automatic switch. You connect two wires up here. It runs down through here, goes under, and goes over to the thermostat control wires at the condenser. All you have to do is break that contact. So on the transfer switch, we have a red and white. And think about it this way. You have this one wire right here, right? That's at the condenser. You take the white wire, you hook it up here. Then you take the red wire and hook it up here. Nothing in between. What's in between is this relay that will signal the condenser to either, uh, sorry, that's a, a relay is basically an automatic switch that gets a signal from the control board inside this module. What will happen is these lights will go out upon utility loss. Then one by one, they will turn on in priority. One is the top priority, four is the least priority. So as you can see, we have one condenser here at the house. The white wire is connected and then comes through the relay. It goes back out through the red wire. It's easier if I draw a uh, diagram, but I'm in the field right now, so can't do that. But think about a light switch. This is an automatic light switch that has smarts built into it from that control board. Anyway, hope this helps. Load shedding is a priority on all these units. It should be, at least. Never install a unit powering an entire house with a condenser without load shedding on at least majority of the condensers. Thanks for watching.